Hey folks, and thanks for stopping by. I found something in Shotcut today that hopefully will be of use to some of you. Um, let me go ahead and get a project started. Uh, I was using OBS today, and I was wanting to export a video using hardware encoding. Uh, now I'm on an older system, and this system has an NVIDIA GeForce 750 Ti, and you know, it's a Windows 7 computer. This is not my usual workstation. I actually have a laptop that I use uh, that has a better GPU in it than this does. But the issue that I had was uh, hardware encoding wasn't working for me. Now, honestly, on this computer, I don't know if I had used it before and it just kind of lost its mind. I'm, I'm not really sure. So I'm going to drop in this one minute long video and I just want to show you something. I'm not going to put any filters on it or anything. I'm going to drag it down here to the playlist and uh, go ahead and export it uh, automatic or default. Sorry. I'm going to go ahead and export it as default. I'm going to turn off hardware encoding. I want to show you something right quick. So this is a minute long video and we're exporting. We're going to go ahead and call it OBS test CPU. And as you can see, this test, um, 34 seconds to render n using the CPU. So here's the issue that I ran into. I was going to use the hardware encoder, and I went to configure, and it had these two checked. And then I figured, why not just hit the detect, and it'll detect mine, and blah, blah, whatever. It'll, it'll find it. So now it says found H264. Uh, earlier it was saying nothing found so I tried to export it and I got audio only which was awful so I'm gonna go ahead and check both of these I don't even know what this means but both of them were checked by default so I'm gonna go ahead and check it again uh, and it's not gonna add any render times but using the hardware encoder that has these two checked you'll see a big difference in the time over here hopefully if I'm right. So we're going to go ahead and export it and we're going to call this one GPU. And as you can see, yes, we knocked about 13 seconds off of the render time out of 34 seconds. So that is quite a bit of time taken off of a render, especially if you have a longer video with uh, several filters on it if you're doing audio adjustment or any type of uh, texting overlay or anything like that. So hopefully this helps you guys out um, using the hardware encoder. If it's not coming out right, update your drivers. Give that a shot because it turns out that my drivers were uh, 341.11 and the latest driver is in the mid 400 somewhere. So uh, yeah, you update your drivers and hopefully that'll solve the problem. I want to thank you guys for stopping by. I want to thank you for checking out this video. If it helps you out, give me a thumbs up. If it didn't help you out, sorry. Let me know what you'd like to see. Leave it in the comments below.